Well, this um, this series that we've been working on right now is is kind of about um, illustrative tattooing or storytelling <laughs> within tattooing. So I'd, I'd like to yeah. uh, to kind of transition a little bit into that because you have a, a, a recognizable and 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 unique style that blends a lot of you know kind of illustrative organic stuff with a lot of like bold geometric pattern based stuff. Sometimes, how do you approach? storytelling do you consider storytelling uh, in your work at all or um, if not how do you approach your kind of illustrative style you know uh, i guess illustrative work is like the definitions get really murky on it uh, i always like to ask people when they ask about anything illustrative like what does that mean you know i know what it means to me uh, i always just try to think of it as you know how i think most people even now think of it just stuff that's a little heavier on the drafting side, on the you know drawing skill, refined drawing, not necessarily graphic or shape based drawing, or you know even folk art style, like a little more like um, you know uh, just traditional work, where it's you know heavy on the the symbolism. And uh, so I think when people talk about illustration, they're like, okay, well I want that, or I want to be able to have that, but I also want the thing drawn really fucking cool, you know. And so that seems to be it. I worked with a guy, Tony, uh, years ago, who was a phenomenally talented, you know, illustrator, draftsman, drawer, whatever you want to call it. He had a lot of people come in asking for cheesy beach tattoos, which most of us would roll our eyes at, and he could make it look fucking amazing. And so that's kind of what I think of as illustration or that set of skills, that drafting skills, because he can take a dolphin and a sunset and this thing we've all done a million times and just don't even want to touch again, if we could help it and somehow make it so cool that you kind of want to get it, you know? <laughs> so that's what I think of when I think of illustration is just the higher level of drafting skills and refinement. Uh, uh, that's, you know, when people come to me and they tell me, Oh, I, I like an illustrative uh, tattoo or I like something illustrated you did. It's usually something that looks more like refined classic art, but it's more line based and punchy, or maybe like the classic golden age of illustration and, you know, magazine cover kind of illustration with that really classical look.